Howdy, folks, and a good day to y'all. Day you're in luck, as the honor is mine to give you a rundown of all the different lab spaces here at Those Vegan Cowboys. Let's first pay a visit to the Bell of the Ball, our grass-fed stainless steel bovine by the name of Margaret. The difference between her and the regular cows is that she demands up to five times less land, consumes hardly a drop of water, and doesn't cause all that nitrogen to be pumped into the landscape. So, how does Margaret get to produce her milk without all that nonsense? Let's start at the ranch. Here, our molecular miracle workers take certain genes and introduce them to a yeast or fungal strain. If all goes well, they're ready for the next step at the open range, where our fermentation specialists take them for a spin. They have a whole set of small fermentation vats in which strains can be grown. If all goes as planned, they're moved on to the cattle drive, where their microbial metal is put to the test. At the cattle drive, we have some smaller vats standing beside our prize cow. Margaret in her working uniform. The proteins are separated from the fermentation broth that's produced here before they move on towards the fabled Calamity Mine, where protein solutions are stripped down to their very essence. When all is said and done, the proteins that are isolated here will form that block of cheese that we're dreaming of on awards unknown territory where analytical experts work to reveal the mysteries of milk proteins in this wild and wondrous place the protein batches from all the other parts of the ranch are analyzed and i suppose it wouldn't hurt to give you a quick glimpse of the cheese cavern well, there ain't much i can tell you much less show you but suffice to say that our first real cheeses might just be behind this door. That's all for now, but rest assured, you'll be hearing and eventually eating plenty more from us at those vegan cowboys.